Pie Master. Welcome back to my channel, everybody, and the Pie Master's channel. And today I'm back in New Yorkshire and I've come down to Wakefield. And the uh, yeah, the car park's the car park's really really bumpy. Look at this, look at that. The pay station over there is out of order. And we've checked most of the cars, none of the well, none of the cars in this car park have a ticket, so there we go, it's gonna be free parking today, which we love. Anyway, let's get into Wakefield. Have a damn good look around. Weird journey here, believe you me, there's a lot of road works going on in Wakefield. There's huge roundabouts on the way in, and a lot of it's blocked off, so you're not quite sure which way to go. So that was a challenge in itself. But hey, I'm here, Bye, Masters here. So, let's have a look, hey? Nova's Health, NHS, nice glassy glass building. Right next door, the Providence. Is it a pub? Probably. Here we go, heading into the centre of Wakefield. On the way, I just spot uh, the ruins of a church. I'm going to try and get in there. I think it's fenced off, fenced off though, so I may not be able to. Have a look at the signs there. See what we got. Istanbul barbers, Turkish barber. You don't see many of them around here, do you? Okay. Market quarter. Cathedral, yep, City Centre Bus Station, City Quarter, Westgate Railway Station, Police Station, Register, Office, right, don't know where to go first, Pie Master's decided, we're going that way, so let's go that way. Outside the Sofra Turkish Grill, look at this wonderful little area, with AstroTurf, beautiful, are these real? No they're not, oh, oh. cheapskates. Still, looks bloody lovely, doesn't it? Yeah. Bellu cheese? Rustico. Quite a lot of Rusticos around. I've seen quite a few there. We've got a very, very tiny one in Mac. That's a lot bigger. Calderman Hobbs. Is this a wet spoons? Drag Fridays. I'll give that a miss. Thanks a lot. Drag DJ. Really? <laughs> No thanks. Roll battery. Okay, judging by that spire there, I would say that's the cathedral. So we'll get a lot closer to it. And have a look. Nice. Another Turkish restaurant. I can imagine there's a lot of Turkish people in uh, Wakefield. There's your Wakefield centre. Bull ring house, okay. Okay. Les is Les is Les is off. Pie Master's off, he's on his way. Well oh, this looks like the very centre. We'll branch out in different directions. Very nice it is. And uh yeah. One bug that I've noticed about it straight away is there's lots of trees. And we love to see trees. Ooh. And there's your Polsky Sklep or Zalek. And they do Siaska, Slodis, or Walks, and what is what? No, I don't know either. And in keeping with the British cafe culture, here we have lots of outdoor seatings for coffee from Sunkist. Tanning, sorry, tanning? Liking the look of that spire. Loving the look of that spire. Inspiring. No, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Now, oh. it's a little bit grim, but yeah, I've seen worse. Some more outside coffeeing. Now the architecture, there's a much nicer architecture elsewhere and I'm going to find it. Here we go. Very nice too. Very nice too. A picnic. <laughs> Mr. G. Barbershop, barbershop. <laughs> Very old fashioned. Even the barber's pole outside. Nice. 
Oh. Nope. Wakefield's Card Factory. And I've been reliably informed by one of my top viewers that it's not closing, or they are not closing. Mmm. Looks to be a very, very nice bakery indeed. Uh, up there. Mmm. Not much going on up there, is there really? JD, King of Trainers? I don't think so. Muffin break. Cafes everywhere. JD has got a hideous looking building. Loads of little side streets there. Give it that. All the trees seem to have disappeared. Modernistic brutality. Mm. And Nor is really, really nice little coffee shop there. Uh, I couldn't get any closer to filming, unfortunately, because of all the copyright music playing as you get in most little uh, shopping centres. This being Trinity Walk Shopping, Tweez, Trinity. Now, Wakefield's rugby team, I believe, are called Trinity Wildcats. There's a lot of Trinity going on in Wakefield. And the rugby club, well, it's only marginally worse than the one I support, which is Warrington Wolves. What's this up here? This beautiful, beautiful construction. Looks nice, doesn't it? <laughs> Our Trinity Walk. Oh, Greg's. There you go. Oh, Greg's. Greg's. Yeah, it's obviously something under construction. Is it going to be a car park? More shops? Take your pick. Appen, we'll go down that way. Appen. Ooh, uh. <laughs> that's very hard to go in it. Or oh, whatever, whatever. 1970s, 1970s, bit of retro building. That's something horrible above Bernardo's. But opposite that. Oh, yeah. Look at that beauty. Stunning, man. And look at all the trees in this part. All these fellas got down here. Oh, that's an ice cream. That was an ice cream. Oh, look at this. Fantastic, man. This must be their cathedral. Let's see if we can get inside it, eh? Nice to see some greenery there. Absolutely wonderful. Oh, Mark Spencer's is not closed. <laughs> Someone on the roof up there. You ready? There we go. My master's doing the sensible thing, he's heading towards it, he's heading towards it. Oh, what happened to that? Monstrosity. <laughs> oh. This is why I come to places like this. Oh, the doors are open. Let's get in, see if I can do a little video inside, because that does look quite spectacular. Saw ourselves coming in on camera. Now, there won't be much talking in here because it is a place of worship. I don't want anybody getting dismayed. So here we go. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. That's I'm, I'm, I'm just about to change. I've, I've gone from medium format down to what is basically compact camera yeah and I, I keep seeing different ideas so what's this one I go for this it. Is the, uh, no I, I don't use GoPros I use no. DJI you can see us now the DJI action 3 oh, they're a lot they're a lot cheaper than GoPros what sort of money, money is that uh, it's about 300 right and does that handle come with it or is that an extra oh, I bought that separate the handle yeah but it's it records in 4k resolution 
12 uh, megapix megapixel camera. But so the video is the video quality is outstanding. I've heard that. I've heard Absolutely that. incredible. Yeah. It's my go-to camera. This everywhere I go to do vlogs, I take this camera with me. Right. Of course, that, that'll crunk back with it, so you can hold it like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It has a horizon balance on it, so even if I tilt the camera, when you replay the footage, it all stays straight. Really? So it doesn't matter if you move it around, it'll all stay perfectly focused and straight. That's the beauty of them. And how do you get that film There is actually an SD card under this flap. Right. And inside there is an SD card. You just take that out, put it to a card reader, yeah. straight into your computer, yeah. and it uploads immediately. Straight away. All your, all your, all your film and your footage is on your computer. I ain't got a computer. I, I, I've got a, a phone and a tablet, a big tablet. Yeah. And do the same. That's you'll, get it, you'll get it. Up, yeah, that's how I do it with, with my uh, filming now. That uh, You can't get high resolution off a compact camera. No. And it shows. It really does show. Yeah, this is the thing. That's why I bought one of these. I mean, uh, I've had various cameras in the past, but this was the best one I bought. It's also the cheapest one I've ever bought. And that, there's a new model of this out now. This is the Action 3. There's actually an Action 4 out now. You can see the vividness of that picture. Oh, it's incredible. When you play it back, oh, especially in a place like this, it's very good in low light as well. So it'll pick up every single detail. All the architecture. I come in for the architecture because it's absolutely yeah, beautiful. I, I do exactly the same. <coughs> I'm a Christian. <laughs> so. I'm not. I'm, <laughs> but uh, I, I love cathedrals. I, I've been to them all. Yeah, that's beautiful. That's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? I've never been here before. I live in Macclesfield, which is about an hour and a half away uh, by car. But, uh, my, my last job in, in my life, I'm, I was a lorry driver. For, oh, uh, were you? Oh, yeah, right. so, oh, brilliant. Yeah, absolutely, because if, if you're driving it, you haven't got time to see it. But of course, it goes in there. Yeah. And now, I, I, I can't, don't drive, so I travel by train. Newcastle's my favourite. I haven't been to Newcastle yet, but I will. Oh, good Newcastle. I, will I can't even show you. I brought, I, I brought my phone. Oh, shit. Just got onto your computer and ask it for the quayside, and you'd be off yeah. like a rocket. All the bridges, oh, wow. all the history. I, I, I also fly drones. I have DJI drones. Do you? The camera resolution is, exact, is, is, is as good as this, if not the same. Exactly the same. The Ukrainians, aren't they? You're using that to. to oh, mine are very, very small drones. What's this? That's the lens, that's the, uh, that's the actual lens. That's oh, of course it is. Yeah, that's I, the camera lens. I can't see very well. On the top of here you've got, that's the record button, turn record on and off. And on the side there, turn the camera on and off. It's a touch screen so you can alter settings and all sorts. Can I feel it? Yeah, of course you can, yeah. Oh, that's nice. I'll, I'll, I'll buy one of those. Sim D simple as that. DJI Action 3. Yeah. And the and where, best where, of you, where did you get the handle from? I got it on Amazon. I think the handle's about fifteen pound. It also is a tripod as well, so oh, good handles. I can pop the uh, camera down because it shoots hyperlapse video as well. You can leave it running; it'll do a hyperlapse. So what's that? It's it's, it's like sped up. Oh, right. I just left yeah. it near a road and let it record for about half an hour. You get five minutes of really rapid moving traffic. It's very interesting. Oh, I'm pleased I sat there and saw you with that. Oh yeah. Please oh, get yeah, one. Please I'm, get one. I'm, my, Let me my just turn this off. I'll tell right, I'll continue the tour now. That was one wonderful gentleman. Ex Army Air Force. What he's flown and seen and done, you wouldn't believe. Anyway, let's continue with the tour of the cathedral itself. Wonderful roof. Wonderful roof. Naturally, the most beautiful windows you can ever see. Look at the architecture and the pillars, stunning. That gentleman was, he was what a gent, what a super fella. Amazing. Right down to the small windows up there. Mm. 
Look at those carvings. And the painting is probably gold leaf. Well, Wakefield, I love your cathedral. Even the tiny door. I see they have wheelchair access in that other place. back outside. Morning. Beautiful. Wow. Here comes security. so I didn't flinch. <laughs> okay. I got a good look around. Start my way back outside into the sunlight. See what else we can find. In Wakefield. Now then, someone please tell me what this is. If you're from Wakefield, please let me know what this is, why it's here. What does it represent? I don't know. Look at this fella. <laughs> it's great. It's metal. Don't know what it is, but I want one. <laughs> That's great. In it. Now, apart from the leaves on the floor. It's very tidy, it's very tidy, the town centre. And then, um, not very keen on that up there, but then again. So what? That fellow in the church, cathedral, sorry. It was absolutely awesome. What a lovely old gentleman. X Forces, uh, what, a, what a start. And as you saw, he's going to get a DJ Action 3 because he loves cameras like this. And he'll do well with it. Selfie space. You can go in there and take pictures of yourself all day long. Ambulance. That's not coming down here, is he? No. Montgomery's is no more. Shame. Closed. Brickwork fast deteriorating. Cathedral, the architecture is not much to speak about or write home about. It's a nice tidy place. Very little litter on the floor, very little. Don't know what it'd be like on a Saturday or a Sunday morning. I should imagine it'd be littered then, but over here. Wreck. <laughs> E6 shop closed. God, never thought I'd see one of them shut. Reflections bar. Is it open? I don't know. Looks like a bit more interesting down there. Let's get on down there and have a look. Nope. Nice day though. Here we go. If you love sparkly and glass, 
this is the shot for you. Everything's just sparkly. Lovely. Mm. Love that. That full tower. And the HSBC looks pretty nice. Brick and liquor. Nice. And here, Hogarth, Union Bank. It's a pub. Whoa. Big grand for a pub, eh? Pretty green. Ask anything off when they were uh, painted it. Looks like it's painted again. Oh, look at the old picture house. Good God, man. <laughs> just up there in the doorway of a pub. I've encountered the Wakefield Crackies. A stack of weed, and they just look like, whoa, not only wasted, but look, they could do with a bloody good meal. What here? Lovely up there. Very grey down there. Lala's restaurant. The Royal and Opera House. Very pretty. Hood bikes. Lovely. And a lovely little plethora of useful shops. <laughs> Above. Very attractive living accommodation maybe? Or maybe not. Hmm. Well, something I have noticed. Mount uh, Wakefield is, well a lot of it is very, very run down. Well, the cathedral is absolutely beautiful. Mm. Yorkshire Barbers, makes a change from a Turkish one. Getting the shopping delivered. Oh, the black swan hidden around the corner. Oh, that's nice. Painting up again, but Yep, could be lovely. You know, we get spoiled by visiting places like Chester and uh, Nantwich. You come to a huge place like Wakefield. It's tidy, it's just tatty. Tatty but tidy, that's what I'll say. You can make your own mind up about it. That's not been cleaned or looked after. At all, what a bloody shame. It would be lovely. A few high rise over there. Anyway. Marmalade on the square. I prefer marmalade on toast. Cubana. Not sure what that is, a bar of some description you should imagine. It's a nice building. It's a pub. The Blind Pig, a drinking establishment, a very nice one too. I think we're back almost to where we started from. Back in this little uh, square, if you can call it a square, the boring houses. Wakefield Centre. This is trees. Well, I think that's about does it for Wakefield, to be honest. Been out quite a lot of the old side streets. Had a good look around. And uh, yeah, mixed feelings about this place, very mixed. 
cathedral makes it stand out. The rest, it just looks very tidy, uh, untidy. Tired, I think is the right word. But anyway, from me and Bymaster, because we're in Yorkshire, me and Bymaster, if you enjoy the video happen, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Most of all, a thumbs up. Not found any pies either. Not found any pies. What is it with Yorkshire? Anyway, up and we'll be off now. Get back in my car, make my way somewhere else, and continue doing what I do in my spare time. Film. So, Macman out. And I'll see you next time. I'm out and about. Take care all. One last look at Wakefield. That's it.